Beats, and welcome to another episode of No Producers Left Behind. So in this video, I'm actually going to be showing you how to save up space that you didn't even know that you had, pretty much. And maybe some of you are know, you know, you're pretty tech savvy, so you know um, how to do this, but most people don't. And um, in my last video, I can't really show you the video. I recorded a video a while ago of me deleting files, but if you watch my last video for the No Producers uh, Left Behind series, you'll know that my videos got deleted, so I can't really show you, but I'll, sh but I did um, have 60 gigabytes that I like just of space that was filled up by random stuff that I didn't need on my computer. So I'm gonna show you how to do that now. So what you wanna do is um, hold the Windows button, like the Windows icon, it should look something like this right and press R and this should pop up right here this little box and I'll, I might put the buttons up here I'm not sure and what you want to type is temp and mine might be empty I'm not sure so it's not so what you want to do is I'm going to press control a right and I'm just going to delete all of these and some of them might not delete because if you might have programs open that need this and basically this is what it says it is. it is it's just temporary data on your computer that you don't need so I just delete it maybe like once a month I just keep doing this skip until it's finished and this one is like the mini one the one that you really want to worry about you just do the same thing again you go to the Windows button and press R oh, not the one. press R and you want to type the percent button temp and then the percent button again. And this might, depending on if you've never done this, you might have like up to 100 gigabytes of free space you haven't even seen, right? And it'll be a long list, even longer than this. Mine, I just did this yesterday for mine and it's already full like this. So imagine over a year if you haven't done this. So same thing, control A to select all and I'll delete. And it might be like a gigabyte or not, I'm not sure, see? See how much this is from yesterday. And see, that's all that space. 10 gigabytes of space. Delete that. Let that run. So you can really see you know this and this is from yet this stuff like I said is from just yesterday when I was making beats and making videos and you know editing and all that stuff so just imagine what you know how much space you can have if you haven't done this ever so it's almost done and I think this deletes it temper I mean not temporarily but permanently but I usually just go up here and just right click and delete everything anyway it will hurry up <clears throat> all right so there will be some left because um, there might be stuff that you have open that can't that is required this is required to be open for like I have like Photoshop open and stuff so that's why this folder's open and all this other crap so you can delete that and then I just right click on this and empty the bin and it'll just delete those and now your computer will be free and it, it will run faster as well because it's not holding on to those files. It's not trying to remember those files, you know. So if you do this, you'll have more space definitely and your computer will run faster. So um, subscribe if you're new. If you're a turner, subscribe and uh, I'll see you guys next video. Peace.